Last time on KLX Country. Alright, almost dropped her. Holy crap. So many switchbacks are a little tight. <laughs> Definitely a lot less scary coming up here when you know that you're going to come to a road that you're going to be able to get out on and you're not going to have to, uh, you know, you're not going to have to backtrack. But that's why I don't know if I want to go past the main road and go on the other side. I'd never make it up all this if there was mud. man said they let the water out in the winter. I wonder why they would do that. I wonder if I ever if I'll ever remember to google it. But I did notice several lakes, several lakes, several lakes I passed on the way here that were definitely a uh, a lot lower. I'm really glad I didn't rip that out when I went last time. Or well, I probably wouldn't have been able to get up at that time. Yeah, I don't know. That side by side might make it. It seemed like it was pretty darn wide though. What's the turning radius? Because some of these are some pretty tight switchbacks. Switchback. No, no. Switchback. Switchback. There's that one. Yeah, this is literally the trail before, which is insane because I don't even see a trail. But I can see on the map, that's where it was. rocks make for a, a hell of a different ride. They entirely change the nature of the trail. Some 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 in some ways good, some ways bad. Like they definitely give you more uh, <coughs> traction going up if they're not too big. And if they're not too wet. But if it's a little bit choppy muddy dirt and you got some rocks embedded in there, oh, it makes it so much easier to get up the hill. I don't have enough experience going downhill, so I don't really know how it affects that. And here we are.
I think I'm going to try it for a little bit. You can always turn around. I'm getting too sketched out. I'm assuming they fix this side the same as the other and it's not going to be too insane. He said as he looks straight down a hill. I don't know. What do you think? That is quite the downhill and it's real rocky and a little bit rutted and a little bit messed up and I don't know how easily I could get back up. I don't know. Half of me is like do it, half of me is like don't do it. Semi loose shit. Shoulda thought about that before I even came this far downhill. Spin this bitch around. Yeah, this is uh, I need a buddy. I need a motorcycling buddy that's younger than me and more capable. <laughs> to tackle this stuff with. loaded up and gone we are alone once again if I was on the Suzuki I mean I could probably stick it in my camelback and still do it but yeah if I was on the Suzuki I could just go back to that spot and then just run the drone down the trail <laughs> try to see how insane it is yeah it's already one I got here at 11 I've already been here two hours hour and 20 minutes to get back to the house probably 30 minutes to load up change clothes Stomach's making weird noises. I'll do one more round, at least to this first part. I'm going to wreck if I keep on doing those wheelies. Oh my lord. I need to stop. wants to go drive drive around on the bottom of that lake bed now that's got to be a ticket see so what the f is this then oh this is this is where the oh my god I thought I thought I had lost my freaking inReach Mini. But that's just somebody's. Still works. Full battery.
I mean, it's kind of silly, but I'll take it back and I'll put it on that, uh, Yep. I'll take it back and put it on the thing. Yeah, we, we could backtrack a little bit. This looks way less sketchy. We could backtrack a little bit and see what's what.